What's going on, everybody? It's Hot King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. We are here to talk about NBA 2K13 and basketball in a whole. Now, I know a lot of people like we. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I got D Coop on my channel right now. If y'all don't know who he is, you definitely want to check him out. Hey, Coop, say what's up to them, man. Oh, uh, what's up, everybody? It's D Coop back again with another commentary. You guys probably aren't used to hearing that on this channel, but anyways. We try to drop some facts on y'all real quick on this 2K13, so let's pick it up. Well, starting off, um, I just want to tell them that I've been watching your videos since I, before I started YouTube. Um, when I first came into the game, I didn't know nothing about sports commentaries. I was recording with my phone, yelling and screaming and cursing. And, and then I caught on to something called Mellow Mondays, and I was like, yo, this is real chill. I could do something like this one day, and ever since then, I've just been watching your videos. Oh man, Mellow Mondays, that's a throwback. And I remember you. I remember you used to comment on those. You said something one time about hitting up E3. Then you said something about a discount. Now that's really what caught my attention. I was like, oh damn, I get a discount on these tickets too. Yeah. Right, and we never we never went out there to E3 yet though. Yeah, man. I don't know why, man. It's always been pushed back, but hopefully next year, you know, Machinima will try to get us a room or something where we just gonna have to come out of pocket, man. Cause you know how they doing us right now, man. Uh yeah, most definitely. It's a struggle out there. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing. But yeah, man, from the start, I work at the airport, so you know me, I fly free. I'm I'm flying anywhere. But i I do have those discount tickets still on deck, man. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie about that one. That's yeah, real rap. But let's get into this 2K13, man. First off, um, everybody that has been playing the demo, I know you've seen a few things that you want tweaked. And I know that we have a couple things to talk about, but for the main part, if you ain't played the demo yet, you are out of your mind. The game comes out Tuesday. They only gave us one week. They trolled the hell out of us, man. Hey, Coop, I, everybody already knows on my channel that I didn't play the game early. I didn't test it yeah. out. Give me your thoughts. The demo, the demo, I turned the demo on. The first thing I heard was the soundtrack. The soundtrack was disgusting. I mean, disgusting in a nice way. So I was hooked from the start. I actually had to get my control. I had to turn the volume up. The presentation was most definitely amazing. So once I turned the volume up, I actually get to play in the game. I had to figure out these new controls. Like, am I the only one that's been struggling to start off with the controls? Like, the features and all the stuff is just completely different to me. Yeah, that's that's one thing that we failed to see. When we went to go test the game out, we didn't have no start menu. When they put the little, uh, I guess it was like a hard drive in, it just automatically started the game. We saw like a little bit of pregame show. LeBron was in his uh, warm-up throwing the powder. Like that's how bad it was. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> yeah, so it like we really didn't get to see no presentation, man. But the, the way the demo looks, it looks good. It plays fluid. But everybody already knows I have my little pet peeves about it because when I went to go play the game, we were bounce passing our asses off. Like, <laughs> I was bounce passing all game long. Shakedown was doing the same thing. And getting used to the control stick wasn't that hard. But what's your thoughts on, you know, gameplay-wise from NBA 2K11 and NBA 2K12 opposed to 2K13? Oh, well, first I want to start off. I want to say I'm hurt. I wasn't invited to come out there. But, you know, next year is another year, another day. Anyways, to talk about this 2K13, 2K11, 2K12 gameplay, the transition has been amazing. 2K13 feels completely different from 2K12. And I'm going to find probably a good bit of people who disagree with that. But in the same in the same air, you can't ignore the, the physics changes, the, the contact the animations they've added so many new animations you got people following their shots after jumpers you have people actually breaking people off after crossovers I'm, I'm i'm a post player i've been a post player but i'm a fan of a nice crossover like if you make somebody slide i'm going to notice that <laughs> <laughs> that's that's one thing i wish i could have recorded man i i don't even know if i did it in a live stream but i was playing and i, I got westbrook and Chambers had the nerve to fall on his ass. And I hit the jump shot. I was like, <laughs> I said, did that just happen in a real game? I was like, I was like, they done brought the falls back, man. They got people, yeah. they got people falling everywhere, man. Um, they got the signature skills popping with the brick wall. I ran into a pick. I almost died. Was like, it from Perkins? Yes. 
it was it was it was impossible to get through man like literally he stiff like it it felt like a stiff arm but (laughs) he was just standing still i was like i was like where did that pick come from but that was that was a heck of a pick man i'm liking the signature skills so far because everybody has something different to bring to the table it's not you just build your guy up to 99 you give him some abilities and you're done with some of these players, they got the chase down block. They got the the, the pickpocket. They got the, the the active hands. It's just so much you can do with these signature skills. I just can't wait to build my my player, man. Real right. Yeah, for real. Like me, I I haven't really looked in that much into the signature skills. I was actually supposed to do a video about that. I was at, I was about to ask you what signature skills are you looking at. I heard you get like five or something. So what you <laughs> yeah. checking out? Well, me to tell you the truth, with my point guard. You already know I'm going to go with, you know, uh, like a floor general type of deal. Me being an acrobat. Me definitely having, like, active hands or, like, you know, um, being in the lane to take passes. And you know I got to go with the ankle breaker. It's only right. I love getting to the rack. I love, you know, just yamming on people, going in for the contact. So, acrobat and ankle breaker will be the definite first two that I go after. And I'm definitely going to go for probably... I'm going to go for interceptor over pickpocket because I love playing passing lanes. But when it comes to playing all ball defense, I don't like to spam the steal button too much because I don't like getting fouled out of games. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm definitely not going to do that. But um, for the most part, man, um, the last one, I guess you could say, give me, give me, give me the, give me the microwave. I, the I microwave. ain't going, yeah, I ain't going to take the the closer because I, I'm not usually the one closing games. You know, if I'm if I'm not up by uh, by a bunch, it's gonna be a long road. <laughs> so oh. yeah, just get just give me the heat up joint. I will take the microwave. But but what I'm, would you pick out of all the signature skills? Do you do you know like all the the certain ones? I actually don't, but I know you can help me out on some of them. I, I actually know the acrobat. I'm feeling that one. My dude Adrian Cooper, your shooting guard. He always been one to get into the lane. Probably gonna have the ankle breaker. Probably not going to have the floor general. Probably going to take a little ball hog route in the 2K13. I, at least I can admit it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, how about this? How about the highlight film? The highlight. That's 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 it. And is that the one where you dunk on people? Like, what's the one where you, you smash on people? Um, I think that one is the posterizer. It's like the Blake Griffins and the John Smiths. So, I mean, so what's Josh the Smith. What's the difference between those two? All right. Basically, it's like this. With the posterizer, it's a player that when the defender steps up and, and, and tries to, you know, step up in your lane of traffic, you put them down. Straight oh. up balls in their face. There's nothing they can do about it. <laughs> now, a highlight film is a player like JaVale McGee throwing it off the backboard to himself in a, in a fast break situation, not worrying about nobody on defense. Oh, Some, yeah. Somebody that gets to the rim and does, you know, spectacular dunks and up and under layups and freaky, you know, just a straight yeah. up highlight reel. You know, somebody like Gerald Green that comes up, catch an alley-oop and windmill it, you know, stuff like that. That's 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 basically what Highlight Film is. Oh, oh, snap. Yo, give me those four and add closer on top of it. I like the microwave, but I want the one taking the last <laughs> shot. So give me the closer, too, and, and I'm done. Are you done? Fourth quarter, that's it? <laughs> <laughs> it's over. All right, I like that. I like that. But, man, I tell you the truth, man, my career is going to be great. I cannot wait to get my hands on this game. And me and you was talking before we started this up, and you told me to make a video asking my fan base, my subscribers, people that that I'm talking to constantly on Twitter, if anybody is getting an early copy of the game, to hit me up in my inbox because I need the game early as well. I'm trying to be on the same level playing field as y'all. So definitely, man, look. All I'm asking is, man, I pay the tab. I ain't saying get it for me. I'll pay my, I'll pay my way. So <laughs> yeah. yeah, already, yeah. man, the game. I don't, I don't, I don't, that frustrates me. I always want to know how these dudes get the game so early, and I'm always the one outside waiting on release day outside of you know your GameStop or something. Yeah, 12 a.m. Just like everybody else, man. I'm just a regular dude, but dang, can I get some connections? <laughs> yeah, like I see these dudes on YouTube. I was like. I was like, yo, who who is this dude? He had the game like two weeks early. I was like two weeks last year. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> he like he didn't he didn't get very far with it with all them strikes, but he, yeah. he got his followers up, I will say that. <laughs> yeah. He had but, his Twitter in every video, every plug. Oh yeah, oh definitely, man. You gotta plug your Twitter, man. Twitter nowadays is crazy. Matter of fact, speaking of which, it's time to plug yourself, sir. 
oh oh snap well you know you guys can go ahead follow me on twitter at that decoop it sounds just like it is no trickery i wanted to have a decoop son but somebody one of my subscribers took that now, i don't know why i didn't even you told me too i, I don't know why i didn't snag that name when i had the chance yeah but man. yeah you know you know how these fanboys is man they want to be like us sometimes man i'll be telling them look we regular. We like you said, we can't get a game two weeks early, so we ain't nobody special. But hey, exactly. I still say till this day, man, you should hit ball up in the DM and say, Listen, let me just get that name. I'll give you that D You can have Yo, it. I, I, I was going to like I was I was checking out this thing. I said, Hey, you know what? I'll make it fair. I'll hit you with the follow if you give me my name. And I never got a response. Dude has not been on since. I was oh. like, damn. He 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 must have closed that joint down and made another one and said, "Nope, <laughs> never. I'm not. Nope, not not in this house." Yeah, that's crazy. Not, not man. tonight. But um, any last thoughts on NBA 2K13 as a whole with the modes? Anything you might want to see in the game? More more to come. You got any thoughts? Well, one thing that really frustrates me, it really got to me. I didn't understand why blacktop the three on three is not five on five and why it's not full court well i understand why it's three on three and it's not full court i, I think it's not full court for the most part but why is it not five on five at least that's what i was most looking forward to because now it's going to be a not living up to its full potential of what it could have been like i was really hyped for it i'm still hyped for it because at least you get to show off your skills you're my player online we're definitely going to hop on that and and a bit when the game comes out but still it was a little disappointing to me like you know yeah i feel you totally man um i made that crazy rant video about crew not being in the game and to tell you the truth man i I'm, i guess a lot of people may have seen it or may not have seen it but i was watching the 2k launch party um earlier tonight you know you guys are gonna basically know that that joint came out a few days ago if you're watching it now but Basically, Ronnie 2K was throwing subliminal shots saying everything that the fans wanted in the game is in the game. Oh. And I'm like, I'm like, so you saying people wanted a social media uh, feature over crew? So you saying that people wanted my team, which was not even a mode that you guys haven't even spoke on until last week in a game besides crew? I was like, wow. <laughs> I was like, you guys had us vote for a mode that you deliberately knew that you weren't going to put in a game. So, I, man, to 2K, you know what y'all did. It's that simple. I don't care if it was a business move for 2K14, but what you did was disrespectful. I just I just want to put that out there. Yeah, that's one thing. I've, I've been shaking my head for like the past five minutes since you started talking about crew, man. You can't see it, but it's frustrating. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't understand. FIFA runs 11 on 11. Perfect. I mean, it might not be 11 on 11. Let me not say that because I don't really know what the exact numbers are because I'm not a, the biggest soccer fan. But they have large numbers and, and it runs no problem. The, the servers are nice and they don't need to take that mode out and put it back in for sales. And nobody's challenging 2K13 right now. Let's be real. Nobody's on that level. It's not like it's going to hurt your sales at all. Yeah, it may boost some sales for 2K14, but you're missing out on sales you could have had this year too. Mm-hmm. A, 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 oh, man. You don't understand. This one guy said, hey, we got a crew at 55. We ain't getting it. I said, what? <laughs> I said, I said Damn. what? Yo, that's that's real rap boy said, man. We got 55 people. You know what I'm saying? We rotate. We ain't getting the game, man. No crew, no buy. I said, wow. Hey, I, I guess it is what it is, man. But, but for the main thing, man, I just want to say this. If you guys can make 3v3 online using my players, which means six total my players, six total people playing online on your servers, oh, and yeah. you guys say that you store the data from that my player on your website, on your servers, why can't you just make it four more computer players in an arena? That's exactly. crew. That that right there is crew at its at its core. So, I, I, I mean, you know what? We're not going to turn this into a rant. Uh, <laughs> for real <laughs> moving on to the next thing um basically we're going to talk about a little bit of basketball you know um if you guys want to hear about this segment right here i'm gonna I'm drop a little cliffhanger to y'all hey, hey, hey coop let them know where they can hear yeah. this at yo you could head you can head all over to youtube.com slash son like i said it sounds just like it is d-c-o-o-p son and uh, i have part two up on my channel so yeah it is what it is y'all go check it out yeah, like I said, the link will be in the description, suckers. <laughs> <laughs>